What's happening, everybody? Your host, AMF 1534. Here, let's play some more. F <laughs> What's happening, everybody? Your host, AMF 1534. Let's play some more Metal Combat Falcons Revenge and let's kill some bitches. We're starting in America. Let's go kill Garum. Yay! <coughs> Anyways, yes. First opponent, Garum, in New York. This does not look anything like New York, but this is probably also like post apocalyptic or something. Hey, it's Guido! Oh, ho! Who is this who dares fight the battle game with the greatest battler in the world? Guido! Once again, the first of our foes. Remember, charge the laser's energy for energy bolts. Only use turbo shots to defend. Oh, ho! The youngsters have returned. Go! I'm busy and cannot be bothered to babysit. Stick around and I may beat you quickly because it is time for me to go have lunch. Of course, fat ass would be going to have lunch. Alright, well, let's fix his wagon real quick here. So, here we go. I really hope this isn't what New York's gonna end up looking like in a few years. Even though I don't really know what time period they're really talking about here. It's Neo New York, so it's gotta be... I don't even... I don't know. I've never really figured out the whole premise of, like, Neo time-based things. Anywho. So. There's new... There's uh, some new items in this game. Ooh. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, I'm gonna pound my chest and get a shot right in the... right in the chest. Do it. Do it. Interception! And your arm is pretty much gone. Yeah, do it. I dare ya. Oh, you crafty little fucker. Boom! Right in the chest. Oh, no. Shoot you in the balls! No! Ooh, ooh, wow, that hurts. It really hurts, it does. Bomb! Boom! Shkablam! You're fucking dead! Go eat your lunch in hell, you dick. <laughs> <coughs> yes. <laughs> I love that. I love the giant welt under his eye. Shoot! I will not admit that I lost. What a bad run of luck that I have had. Why, I should have beaten you like a dirty rug. You were lucky again this time. Rats! You got the shield. See, this is what I'm talking about. There's new items here, because in Battle Clash, the only items that were available was just the V system and the bomb. There's a whole shitload of things in this one. Select the shield item with the cursor button and press fire to, to use it. The shield will protect your ST temporarily from enemy attack. <laughs> As any regular shield would do. All right, off to Borneo to face Siamang. This guy is so funny. <laughs> I fucking love this guy. He is hilarious with the nice crash plane or whatever this is. Yes, and it looks like a monkey, and so does this guy. Ooh wee! You're the ones who beat my brother Guido, the pilot of the ST Garum. Why, your ST is nothing but a bucket of bolts. I choose not to believe my brother Guido was defeated by a pitiful pile of scrap like you. Partner, be careful, this guy. Be careful, this guy is quick and very, very strange. Ooh-wee! You make fun of me? You must not realize with whom you deal. I will avenge my brother as I destroy you slowly, very slowly, and I will savor every moment. How does this guy look like Guido's brother is my question. Now... I'm going to say something really quick. You can literally beat this guy in like 10 seconds. I'll show you where his weak point is. And I literally, just last night, beat him in like 10 seconds. His weak spot is his tail. It's kind of a hard one to hit because it flips around there like a fucking wing knot. But whenever he does a shot, he will he'll just sit right there pretty much and let you have it. He's probably quite possibly the easiest person in this game to fight. Oh, get it? Yes! God, he's such a vulnerable target. He's such an idiot. Stop sitting there! Eh, what do you do? You do what you, you, do what you gotta do. Come on, white socks. Pull the shit out of your ass. Oh, please! Please spare my life. In return from this day forward, I will take you as my brother. As his eyes were, like, gorging out of his face. It's ridiculous. Asia. Off to Chang's Mongolian Grill to face Wong. <laughs> the most typical Asian name, or Asian last name in the world. Like, Wong and Chang. 
Not like I have a problem against anything like that. I mean, I know a lot of Chinese people. This guy's cool. I like this guy. I am Dayan, pilot of the ST-1. I'd like to see the face of my opponent while you still have one. Do you see us, Dan? We are your rivals. Watch out, partner. His round hands are very tricky. He's also equipped with an anti-gravity engine and can float, <laughs> just like the last two people that we dealt with. My duty is protect Mongolians. I do not like to fight, but must protect my homeland. And I must teach you how sad the battle game can really be. Actually, Dayan, I think that I'm probably going to roast your onion faster than putting it on a grill. His main weakness, if you can shoot the right side of that shield, you're going to do a lot of damage. God, I just can't fucking hit it. Oh, I almost had it. It's a shame. I mean, hitting him in the middle is obviously going to work. His actual weak point is there in the middle, too. But I don't think I'm going to be able to hit it. He doesn't expose it very often. God damn it, I want to hit so bad. Oh. Oh, damn it. This is the guy that I beat. I beat uh, Wong in, like, literally eight seconds. I have a photo of it. I'll even show it to you here right after the thing's done. Just so you know that I'm not lying to you. Interception! Come on, buckle piss. What do you got? Uh, really? That's all you got? Oh, we're gonna go the other way now. I see how it is. Shkablam! Boom! And there he goes. Probably like an old tire or something. Ooh, wow, that's quite the bad welt back there. I have failed. You can do what you wish with me in Mongolia. You've misunderstood. We battle with chiefs only so we may reach Thanatos. I see. I'm sorry that this battle even took place. You see, those who challenged me before only wish to invade Mongolia. I hope you will have success in your quest to challenge Thanatos. You got the new- Oh, I love the Neutron Beam! This thing is fucking tight! Select the Neutron Beam item with the cursor button and press fire to use it. This weapon uses your ST's energy. If you don't have enough energy, it will not fire. The Neutron Beam can damage any ST. Oh, 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 yes. We get to go off to Babel. This fight will also look oddly familiar to a lot of you, for those of you at least that know Battle Clash well enough. Pretty much down to the T. Oh, yeah. It looks a little bit different than the person who did this last time. You're the ones who wants to battle me, huh? To me, you appear to be a spineless wimp. What? I will show you what courage is. Let us battle. Let's see this courage. From here, we will fall towards the earth. If the battle does not finish you, the friction heat of re-entry will. Let us go. Oh, oh man. I really want to use the Neutron Beam. I think I'll do it, actually. I don't even care. I always use the Neutron Beam here. His weak points on him are the little his little horn things up there. Oh, I can't wait for you to sit still. Sit still. Boom! Shkablam! I just really hope I don't get hit. I probably won't. Oh! Yeah, see, that pretty much will do it for him. Boom, baby! Boom, shakalaka! Oh, shit, where's my cursor? Come on, come on, come on, sit still, sit still, sit still. Oh, oh man, that could have been bad. <laughs> Especially since he moved out of the way. Wow. See, the first time he, the first time this happened, I thought this was like an antenna coming out of his face, but then I realized it was just his gay sunglasses. I can't believe that I have lost to mere children, but you are finished anyway. Now you will burn up and you will be gone from this world. <laughs> now feel the pain and die! Grrr. Well, he died at least, but we don't look like we're in much better shape. He seems to be correct. We have no way to stop our fall. Can this be the end? God, it's making my eyes hurt like hell right now. Well, who might that be? Are you okay? We're not injured, but we are trapped by Earth's gravity and cannot stop our fall. You should leave now while you still can, otherwise you too will be burnt by your re-entry. I came to help you, but there's no time to waste if you wish to escape your situation. How can you help us? Who, who are you? 
I'll explain it all to you later. Right now, I'll tow your ST free of Earth's gravity. I've also got something that I'm certain will help in the future. It's the V-System. Remember, time is short. Let's hurry! You got the V-System. You know, the V-System is the exact same thing as it was in the first game. When you use it, it'll center, the, it'll center your opponent, it'll give you a shield, but it uses a lot of your actual energy for your, for your ST, so it's kind of a pain in the ass to use unless it's absolutely necessary. Really good thing for first-time users. I'd tell you the, the fight that it's definitely going to be most helpful in. It's not for a little while, though. Unfortunately, we are done for this episode. We got through the four, the, the force, the first four battlers. Um, when we come back next time, we're going to go off to Moonbase Luna, which in Battle Clash was actually the second to last place. So we're going to fight Viscount. Going to be crazy. Thanks for watching, guys. Getting a little bit of a little taste of my really, really awful voice acting all over again. So you guys take it easy, and I'm going to go watch the rest of this uh, Chicago White Sox Baltimore Orioles game. Peace out. See you guys.